Hey guys, Teacher Emily here. Um, it's been a few weeks since I have done a YouTube video, so I figured I would check in. I also just got my classroom finished, so I'm really excited about sharing that with you. And then I'm going to talk a little bit about how my bookings are during my, today's my 47th day with VIP Kids. So um, I just kind of wanted to talk about a couple things. And my Corgi had puppies, and I'm going to show you a little sneak peek of those guys. They're one week old. Um, today. So you'll get lots of fun stuff in this video. A little classroom tour, we'll talk about bookings, and you'll get a little sneak peek at some puppies. So this is my VIP kid corner in all its glory. I've worked my tail off on this classroom um, from day one to day 47. It's been a work in progress. I have a little corner of our guest room slash storage room slash office. So um, it's not, you know, the greatest setup in all the land, but it, it's pretty good for what I need it for. So this is my background. It's a world map and it's kind of kid oriented. It's got some pictures and um, fun font. And so I've got the United States, which is me. I actually live in Texas. And then it goes over to China, which is them. So that's a nice little visual for them to see how far apart we are. I use this for my rewards. It's just a like baking pan and it's magnetic so all my magnets stick to it and then stickers also stick to it. So I did stickers at three o'clock this morning for one of my kids, one of my girls, ladybugs. Um, but I do uh, stick some magnet rewards up there as well. Over here I've just got some alphabets and VIP kid on a chalkboard. I do keep some 3D props. I like to use my puppet for a lot of things. Again, I'm from Texas. My intro video uh, really shows that I'm from Texas. I'm horseback on it. So I try to do a lot of things Texas themed. So like I've got my cowboy hat when I do, um, if I ever have to wear a hat. <laughs> um, but then I also use finger puppets and just some other stuffed animals as well. Um, I keep this little basket with just various Balls. I need to get a baseball. I did not have that at the dollar store when I went on my my VIP kid prop haul. Um, this is my fun bag. It's got glitter letters and streamers, slinkies. I'm going to use these for Chinese New Year. They kind of pop confetti, so I'm pretty excited about that. Hopefully my family doesn't hate me for life after that. So that's my, my fun bag. Um, I like to keep flashcards and dry erase boards handy at all times. I'm always using those. So for my class this morning, these are magnetic letters and I just uh, pop them on there and we use that for blending. I have just kind of some office stuff back here, miscellaneous. I use this big pencil a lot for when I want them to draw on the screen. I use my lightsaber back here for the Food Ninja lesson that I'm doing a lot of right now. I slice my food with a lightsaber. Um, my microphone for when we sing songs. I got this stuff at um, our local dollar store. It's just um, like photo booth props. It's a bunch of glasses and crowns, hats. There's a set of lips on there and you can just hold them up. They look pretty groovy. <laughs> um, so that's fun. And then I've got these ears that light up. So that's just another silly prop. I try to be as silly as I can with the younger kids. Um, I've got my headphones, of course. Love those. I went on the Facebook group, the VIP Kid Facebook unofficial whatever. You're probably a, a member of that already if you're a teacher. And they have a Google Doc that has every... VIP kid character ever created um, and I just printed all those out I laminated them obviously I use Megan Mike the most uh, but I laminated them and then I used foam tape to stick them on popsicle sticks so they're easily accessible I can grab them just really quickly um, and that's just been super handy and helpful and I just have them in these mason jars and then I also made um, just some other ones like go stop if I'm having a behavior issue I'll just hold this up until my kid settles down and then I'll continue with the lesson. Um, just heart. I've got the flags here in the back and then I teach level one. So we were traveling, you know, through the, across the world. So I've got my little plane with let's go. Um, I wanted to show you, I keep my makeup really handy. 
to do that first thing in the morning. I've got a bucket full of those letters and just some um, rewards. And then I wanted to show you um, my reward system. So I keep all of my rewards here and they're all super handy. And I've got, sorry, my filming's gonna get a little crazy while I'm pulling these out. So I laminated all of the um, reward systems that VIP Kid has, and I made them double-sided so I can write on them, I can tape on them. Um, it's just a really handy way of having rewards. I travel quite a bit. Um, we live on a ranch in West Texas, but the people that we work for, they have a couple of ranches. So we go to New Mexico at least once a month. So I'm traveling, I have some fake money for a reward system got coins too that's good for math as well um emoji stickers fish for finding Nemo stickers I just say fish when I'm using those more fake money they really like this this one came with the money clip princess stickers for the girls star wars stickers they really like those this was all dollar general stuff I found this mama jamma for three dollars and it's got a ton of faces for animals and people that are blank and then in the front it has stickers that you can choose to put on them so I cannot wait to use this as a reward I'm really excited about uh, using this one especially with the my face lesson so that was pretty cute um, and then I just have like some bananas and stuff extra bananas to use as props so that is my classroom. Um, I do want to talk about bookings a little bit. So let's see here. I experienced my first frenzy this week. I've been getting like no bookings. As you can see, last week we went on vacation, so I didn't have all my days open. I taught uh, like three of those classes. Most uh, Two of them were no-shows. Before that, I just, I just have not been getting very many classes. Look at all those slots that I had open. Those two were no shows. So I didn't teach any that week. The week before that, I taught one class. Um, and then my first week, I thought I was going to be lucky. I had, that was my first day to have open and I did teach a class that day. So moving on to this week, I went to bed a couple nights ago and woke up to 15 classes being booked. So I think I'm finally um, things are finally turning around for me. I am not having to check the 24 hour boxes anymore. So that's this week. And then I've got a few classes booked for next week already that I'm just really excited about. Um, so not, not too many, but that's okay for Chinese new year and pretty great for me. You know, I haven't been getting any bookings at all. So having, you know, 15 bookings for the next two weeks is pretty awesome. And I went to bed last night and woke up with like eight more. So that's that's pretty great. I'm, I'm very excited about the way my bookings are going. I will still do a two month update and kind of keep you guys posted on how my bookings are going, if they're still increasing or if they, you know, hit a plateau or just stop altogether. Um, all right, well, y'all take care. Thanks for watching. And oh, I have to show you the puppies. So this is my Corgi Fergie. She's super duper sweet. And she had puppies last week, and they're also very sweet. We've got five beautiful little Pembroke Welsh Corgi babies, and we have two girls and three boys. And they're just the sweetest little things ever, and Fergie's such a good mama. And they really like when you scratch their little tummy. Fergie doesn't like when you scratch their tummies. She's a good girl. But they're cute and they're super fat and healthy. Probably because they just nurse constantly. All right, well, thanks for checking out my classroom and for checking out my little quirky puppies. And I'll post a two month update and let you guys know how everything's going. Adios. Um, I'll be here playing with these puppies and teaching these Chinese kids. Bye, Ferg.
she wants nothing to do with this video. <laughs> Alright, adios.